welcome to Flourish With Him and Faith Blues. We're so glad you're here this evening. We wanted to take a few moments and thank you for all that you do for, um, as far as support for us. As we begin this new journey of sharing the mommy and daughter time and doing makeup reviews and tutorials on how to do your makeup, what else do we do? Um, we do cra paper crafts. We also do Bible journaling, like tips of tricks and tips of how to do your Bible journaling. Which, if you go back to Faith Blooms a couple, maybe a year ago or a couple months ago, we did one together of flipping through our Bible journal. And it was really cool because we saw some of hers and then we saw some of mine. So, it was really cool to do that. But today we're going to be doing a makeup collection review. It's not really a review, or not really a collection, but more of a review. Mm -hmm. But first we wanted to start you out with something that we need to start out with every time. Mm -hmm. And that is a verse of the day. So we're going to pick my life first because this is how it all came about. From having the, this life first, I, I came out of depression and went into like a more serious relationship with God. And so because of that, I'm going to just share. Actually, I'm going to have Hannah read it for us. Okay, so we are reading out of the yes, English please. Standard Version. Okay. For I know the plans I have for you, declares, this is Jeremiah 29, 11. For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans for welfare and not for evil, to give you a hope and a future. So basically that tells me that there is a plan for me, that I will do okay, and that no matter what God throws my way, he is still in control and he will help us. So I hope you enjoy this little video where we talk about our makeup collection and how we're to use it. So do you want to start with yours or do you want to start with mine? Um, we can start with mine since it's smaller. Actually, what about starting with mine since it's right here on top of everything? Just thought. Yeah. Um, so because this is not where I normally put on my makeup, we just kind of brought it all in and threw it at the table. So here we go. In no particular order. Actually, if we have to do it by order, give me the foundation first and put your hand behind it. You can do it if you want. Or okay, I'll, do I'll it. be your model. She's going to be my model. Okay, you talk about it and I'll just show them the product. Okay. So this is the e.l.f. Um, foundation and I currently am only using e.l.f. products on my face for the majority of it. So I will start out with my... <laughs> It's okay, that one doesn't have to be in there. This is my line of defense here. So on this one, I use only at night, and this is the... This is the e.l.f. Hydration, hydrating Serum. Serum, yep. And it's also by e.l.f. And then this one? This one is a daily moisturizer. And I use that in the morning with before purified I put makeup water. on. And that's also an e.l.f. brand. You can find these and at then, Walmart. And then right before I put on any makeup, I do use this one. This one is called Hydrating Face Primer. It's also by e.l.f. So because I have psoriasis, my fa fa face gets really dry. And um, sometimes you'll see like little crevices here where the psoriasis has broke out. And because of that, I have to wear special makeup and special things. So you just saw my foundation and the color of my foundation is snow because I am really, really light, but not as light as Hannah. Um, and then I use the e.l.f. camouflaged um, concealer. After that, I go right into, oh yeah, you can show them that. My, right into a body blender. Uh, beauty blender. Beauty blender, not a body blender. And it also has this little stand where she can take it out and put it back in. Mm -hmm. And so then before I put anything else on, I put on my chapstick. And my chapstick is... She prefers the chapstick brand. And this one is the peppermint... Pep Candy cane. 
Peppermint candy cane. So next we're gonna work on our eyes and what Pets. I use for my eyes. Currently is this little makeup palette by, let's see if I can read it any better here. Rosie Nudges Eyeshadow. Rosie Nudes is eyeshadow. the name of it. And I got this as a, at Target, not at Target. TJ Maxx. TJ Maxx for $4.99. And here's the palette and then there's the back. So I use that a lot and whenever I don't choose to use that, I will either use this one and this is um, sure, sure thing, thing Nude. And it has like a lot of light colors in it. So there's that. This was also at TJ Maxx for $3.99. And then before I got either one of those, I just used this palette. And this palette is uh, iridescent. And inside, when you open it up, if you go to the right side, is just some that is from Sally's, Sally's. makeup. Salon. And you could also find this at Sally's, and they have magnets on this them. This is not sold at Sally's. This I bought off of Amazon, and it was, like, dirt cheap. So, next is what I would use before I put blush and stuff on. Revlon makeup um, highlighters. highlighters. And this is the inside of it. And she'll show you where she can put that at. So when you uh, start it out, you want to use the lightest color. And the lightest color goes up here around your eyes, up into this little portion. And try to draw out any um, things that might be going on there. Uh, so you'll start at the lowest and then you'll go up to this next one. And I'm trying to prevent you from getting a big old camera. Shiny thing. Yeah. And so you'll use this one and it will do this area of your face down here. And then I don't use the heavy, heavy dark one, but I will use this one. And this one does down here, down in this area and around my face. And that is to keep any like shiny things coming off my face. In the last video we did, she was talking about her gel highlighter. Um, so, and it's also by e.l.f. and it's like comes in like a little container. And when you open it, and it looks like this. When you open it, it's like jelly. Ooh, ew. <laughs> it's getting grossed her out. So anyhow, then I have, um. The big bomb, <laughs> the big bee bomb. Then I have my eyelash curler. Nothing spectacular about that. Just a little squirt there and squirt there. So, Hannah, do you want to do yours? Sure. Because I've already done mine today, so. And then you. Ow, I just put my <laughs> skin in there. I'm not really familiar with how to use these things. So, that was her first time using it. That, that's oh all right. Oh, my goodness. That was scary. That was scary. So we got to do blush next. So next, I I still use the Mero Norman blush, and it is called uh, Teakwood, and I have a ton of it left. As you can see, it's like a brownie rose. Yeah. And I just apply that. Like if you go, it goes right here. She likes here, to do the fishy the lips. back. You're supposed to do fish lips. And when I don't, no, I'm not using that. And whenever I don't use that, normally in the summer, I will use this. And this is just a cheap $1 palette from the Dollar Store. Um, next, I will put on my eyeliner. And I like the silver one. And the silver one is from Kiss. And, um... With the kiss one, I just go and do it very lightly right under here. And if I don't use the kiss one, then I've got this one that is from uh, Jordache. I don't think it's from Jordache, though. Metal Rocks. Um, it's Metal Rocks. And I think I might have got this one from... Sally's or Amazon, maybe? No, no, no. From Meryl Norman. I think, 
and so they're just like this and you can see it better if I did that so anyhow that's what that's all about so um, just making sure that you guys know that these are very inexpensive and um, then after that is my lipstick my lipstick that I use well some of my lipstick that I use is excuse me I'll, I'll get to that in a minute what i had on earlier today was this set and this is by covergirl and that is the package for it and that is the number to get it this one is called brazen reason which i laugh every time <laughs> because when i hear it i'm like brazen reason huh and then I use um, this. Um, if you saw in our last video, I showed you guys this. It's a Elf um, a lip um, glosser thingy. Lip gloss? No. Yeah. Thingy. Lip glosser thingy. And there's that. And when I don't use these products, then I like to use this um, product from um, Sam. Not Sam. Sally's. Sally's. And it, it's a purpley collar. Put it up against your hand, please. And they'll see. It is not that color. It's just a little it's bit. It's kind of like a, kind of like a liquid. Like a strawberry almost. And I have a purple one. The same color. But it's darker. So it is based on what is on your lips. Like how deep your lips are. And so it goes by that. And the last thing I need to show you is my finisher brush. And then this matte spray that I have used and I told you about that we got from Five Below. We also use, here's my e.l.f. Um, tweezers. Nothing special about those. And then we got these last year at Christmas time. From Sally's. From Sally's. And they were just cute because she's a little blonde and just I like me. And I also have one that has brown hair. Yep, you were a brunette. So, that's all of my makeup. Oh no, I got tools over there. So here are the last of my makeup. So here is the tools I am currently using. I have a four piece makeup kit right here. Blush brush, highlighting br brush, um, an eye blender and an eye um, And then I um, crease. Mm -hmm. I also have another e.l.f. blush brush. Another, um, this one is not a blender. No, it's a eye crease brush. And then I have one more, which is a um, blending brush. So those are by e.l.f. And then we get picked this up at TJ Maxx the other day. And it's just a pink quartz um, little thing. I like to use it under my eyes before I start. If you use it in the morning, it really helps. Um, so those are the tools we have. Anything else that I forgot? Oh, and of course, when you end your day, you need to take off your makeup appropriately. So you can use these, which are from Walmart, of course. Or you can use um, water, soap and water. Um, another one we just got was Deterra scrub, and so I'm gonna try to use that, and maybe I will try it this week and send a picture in to let you know what it looks like. So thanks so much for watching. And do you want to do yours tonight? Yeah. So we're gonna switch over, and then we will. Give, let her on and I will step back. Can you put this in my make picture? And then this one. We'll just do a fast switch over here. This was the thing that's supposed to be. Okay. So that is all my makeup. And just in case you didn't know what it looks like. That's my makeup right there in a nutshell. Not the second part. 
just this. And I didn't have that much, say, six months ago. So I'm going to let Hina take over while she does her makeup reviews. Okay. So my daily um, makeup is not like hers. Mine is a little bit different. So I use Nivea. Nivea, you can find at um, Walmart. You can also find it at um, any kind of beauty store. Um, it, mine is Smooth Daily Moisturizer. Um, dry skin, so it helps if you have dry skin. So that's what I use for my moisturizer. The next thing I have is, so I have this little like three drawer thing. You can find this at Home Goods if you guys saw our last video. So I have this LA color palette. Which I don't use this much, but um, I do use it sometimes. And then this one is a Blake Brush Polido. It's a blush, so let me open it and show you guys. So there's what it looks like. So there's that, and that's what I use. Next, I have this Biol Beauty Nation. Um, you can find these at Five Below. Um, the colors that I normally use are the cream and some of the pinks and purples. Then I have a four-piece set like my mom just showed you guys. Blush, crease, blending, and eyes. And I also found these at Five Below. You can also get this palette at Five Below. You can get this at Sally's. You can get these at the Home Goods store. Next, I have a foundation blender. I have a palette which has pink, um, so, excuse me, um, brown and tan, or not tan, but like cream. And this one is by Selenquu. I have two of those, they're identical. Um, you can probably find those at Walmart or Sally's. This one's from Sally's, it's just like a white. These are glitters, you can find these at Walmart or Sally's. I think we got these at Sally's. I have purple and silver and white. And I also have this little container like that. Next, I have my lips. For my lips, I have red. I found, my aunt gave me that. This was from Sally's, it's like a pink. This one's from Sally's also. When they had a good sale, this is from Walmart. Walmart, um, also from Sally's, chapsticks. I don't use all of these every day, but these are just ones that I have options for. I use this, and I also have the same um, e.l.f. Um, what is it called? Um, e.l.f. High Lip Gloss. And then I have this Smooth Lips. You can find this at the Dollar Tree. Then I have um, Therapy Lips. It's a rose color. You can find that at Target. And then I have three Carmexes, which I use that a lot in the winter then i have this long lasting lip gloss it's from sally's also and that and i also have this um one that i also got from sally's it's the one that i'm wearing right now so there's that and that's my makeup collection um thanks for watching and bye